Hello. Run, Ryan. <laughs> Today we're going to talk about physics concepts in baseball. <laughs> Mass, first of all mass. Mass is a measure of how much stuff an object has. It's usually thought of as weight, although technically weight is different than mass because you weigh less on the moon, but you still have the same amount of stuff. Mass, because technically it's how much it resists acceleration. If I put the same amount of force on this as I do on this, this is gonna move a lot less. Next we're gonna talk about force. Force is a push or a pull on an object. Let's look at the pitcher. When he's pitching a ball, he's putting a force on the ball to change its velocity. Velocity is how fast something's going and in which direction. So when we say it's going up, it's a positive velocity usually. And when we say it's going down, it's a negative velocity. So that's why you remember 9.8 meters per second squared, usually negative 9.8 because it's going down. Anyway, acceleration, is very simply how fast the velocity changes. There's lots of interaction pairs in baseball. There's the pitcher's hand on the ball, there's the bat on the ball, um, there's my feet on the dirt, which I kind of appreciate because it prevents me from falling through. Remember Newton's three laws? Well, the third one says that every action has an equal and opposite reaction. So when there's a push on an object, the object pushes back. That's why even though gravity is still working on me, I'm not floating, the ground is pushing back up on me with an equal force. Next, momentum. Momentum is the last and it's the most important force in baseball. And momentum is a combination of the mass of an object and its velocity. So the faster an object is going, or the more massive it is, the harder it is to stop and the harder it is to get it going. Remember, I could throw this ball a lot farther then I could throw the bat. In a collision between the ball and the bat, not only is the bat moving about as much or even more than the ball, but the bat is five or six times heavier than the ball, so it always wins in a collision. Anyway, that's it. Hope you learned something. Yes! We're gonna go. <laughs> Baseball weighs probably about five or six ounces, and that bat, Ryan, bat. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>